in KCAL 9's Melissa McCarty is live in Lancaster with the latest on this chase and how it started. Melissa? Well, this all started in Saga. Sheriff deputies say it was a successful bank robbery at Bank of America, which came to an end here in a residential neighborhood in Lancaster. You could see behind me, uh, they pushed us back pretty far to further contain this crime scene, but it came to an end right around the corner from where we are, and uh, it was a cul-de-sac trapping the driver at the time. Now, the chase ended up going along the 14 freeway. CHP tried to stop the driver with spike strips, although he swerved around them. His front left tire appeared to go flat. Now, just as he entered Lancaster, he found himself trapped in this cul-de-sac where we are off of Avenue H, surrounded by about a half dozen patrol cars and residents in this neighborhood. Deputies ordered him out, and when he got out, it appeared he threw a wad of money on the ground. Then suddenly, for some reason, he got back in the truck, faced deputies with their guns drawn on on him for very intense moments that seemed to last forever and that is when bullets started to fly. Oh, shots are being fired. Shots are being fired into the vehicle. <clears throat> Now, we do know that sheriff deputies said that the man, the driver, fired at them first and they responded for the safety of not only uh, the officers but also the residents in this neighborhood. Now, we did a search of the registered owner of that vehicle. This is unconfirmed if it is the man uh, dead right now in the car, but the registered owner of the vehicle is 60 years old, 10 days ago filed for Chapter 13 bankruptcy, also lost his wife. Uh, this year as well at 59 years old. We don't know if this was an act of desperation, uh, grief, but that is all something that sheriff deputies are going to be looking into as this continues. For now, we are live in Lancaster. I'm Melissa McCarty, KCAL 9 News. Back to you. All right, a lot of new information. Live from the GoPro cam, Lancaster, California. And we have some more breaking news right now. Investigators have arrested a suspect in that cold.